Even in the digital age, instant photography has made a big comeback. After all, what's better than an instant physical picture that you can hold in your hands to document a cherished moment you want to remember? Fujifilm has been embracing instant photography since long before we all started snapping pictures on our smartphones. And for less than $70, its Instax Mini 9 camera makes it easy and more fun than ever to celebrate the good times with friends and family. But is this camera really a must-have? In this video, we're going to be taking a closer look at the Fujifilm Instax Mini 9. We'll be going over key features, who this product is for, how it compares to the competition, and most importantly, is it right for you? Stay tuned and let's dive into the video to find out. When it comes to looks, the Fujifilm Instax Mini 9 has rounded edges, which we found to be nicely appealing, and it gives off a very friendly vibe. It comes in five lively hues, cobalt blue, ice blue, flamingo pink, lime green, and smoky white, and is lightweight for easy portability, but it doesn't feel flimsy in your hand. We were able to easily slip the camera into our bag and even our pocket, which made it super easy to always have it with us, ready to go during our tests. The Instax Mini 9 includes a close-up lens adapter that lets you focus on subjects as close as 35 to 50 centimeters. We also especially like the automatic exposure measurement feature, which makes taking the perfect photo simple that even kids can manage it. In addition to the close-up lens, this camera also comes with a wrist strap for easy handling and two AA batteries for power. Getting set up was really easy. We put the batteries in, then loaded the camera with a 10-pack cartridge of Instax Mini film. To note, the film itself has to be purchased separately and doesn't come with the camera. Above the lens are a series of brightness indicators for different lighting conditions. Depending on the conditions, the camera will suggest one of these settings. The viewfinder was easy to use and the film exposure counter let us keep track of how many shots we had left. One of the Instax Mini 9's most unique design features is its selfie camera. Located on the front, right next to the lens, it's basically a mirror that helps you to frame up a selfie so you can get it right the first time without wasting film. Its close-up lens was also effective, although because it is so small, we had to be careful not to lose it. Beyond the literal quality of this camera's photos, it is worth noting that people really seem to like it. Be it the design or the fact that the Mini 9 uses film and is able to produce instant physical photos to share, when we were out and about, people complimented us on it, asking questions and wanting to know more about it. A pack of film runs about $18, and from that, we'll get about 20 shots. But apart from that upfront cost, we'll get a lasting physical memory that a JPEG file just can't compete with. And being instant film, there are no processing costs, so the cost of the film gets you 20 photos all in. In comparison, you could take that JPEG file, print it out, and take on the cost of the photo paper and the ink. So it's a trade-off, a tiny bit pricier for instant convenience and instant sharing. How many times have we snapped a photo on our phone only to literally never look at it again, let alone print it out? The Instax Mini 9 helps us get past the dead zone of images and instantly gave us the real thing in our hand. Plus, every time we walked past our photos, it always brought a smile along with our memories. Bottom line, we found the Fujifilm Instax Mini 9 to be reasonably priced, easy to use, and best of all, it didn't overwhelm us with a bunch of features or accessories that we didn't need. If you're looking for a portable instant camera that's fun and easy to use, we highly recommend the Instax Mini 9. We feel it presents great value and is the perfect way to instantly capture and share memories with family and friends on the spot in a way that a smartphone simply can't do. All right, guys, that's all for now. If you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and leave a like. If you're new to the channel and you liked the video, consider subscribing. We do our best to keep you up to date on the best products on the market right now. So if you want to stay current regarding the best gear, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Be sure to check out the description for links to find the most up-to-date pricing on all the products mentioned in this video. Hope you all have a great day, and we'll see you back here soon for the next video.